So I kind of screwed up a tiny bit. Uh, last video we did a ton of runecrafting. We finished the Falador Elite Diaries, if you remember that. Continuing on the diary trend, I started to do the Fremenic Diaries, the Elite Tasks, and one of them is to kill all three Dagonoth Kings, which I've already, uh, I've killed Rex in the past. I've got 28 Rex KC, so I only killed Prime and Supreme, teleported out to find out that it all reset, so... Yeah, um, I'm now gearing up for the uh, solo Rex kill, just one, and then I'm going to teleport out. Very scuffed gear, I'll explain that later. I ended up buying a few more casts, but I really don't think that was even necessary. Yeah, hold on. Alright, I was about to say, if I didn't get that, I would have been pretty upset. Uh, Alright, got the Ranar weed, got the uh, Dagonoth bones, I'm out of here. So let me explain this absolutely scuffed gear setup. Obviously, you wouldn't go into uh, DKs with that gear. Um, this is my armor setup because another thing that I have to do is kill all four God Wars dungeon bosses. I've already killed Sarah and Zamu, and I know those saved. Like, I know for a fact those saved, so I don't have to re-kill them. So this is my armor setup, and then after that I'm gonna kill Bandos, so... Yeah, hopefully this works for Arma. I've never killed Arma before, but... I'm just gonna crossbow. I could get chins, but I feel like that's not really worth the effort. I'm gonna give it a shot. If it really starts going the wrong way, then yeah, sure, I'll catch some chins, I guess. Uh, but yeah, be right back. You know, if the kill count didn't take like nine years, I'd probably do Arma more often. I mean, obviously I'm only doing it for a diary right now, but there's no way in hell am I camping this boss, dude. If you look closely, you can actually see that this is my second attempt at this. The first one I got Kree really low, but I had to teleport out. I was not going to risk 50 HP, because dying here is uh, just about the last thing I want. I don't think I could recover my looting bag worth of, uh, of stuff from here if I died, so. Alright, take number two. Let's see how it goes. for the armadillo chest. That kill went so much better in comparison to the first one. The first one, it took me five sharks to even get my first hit. This time I only ate like four to get the entire kill, so definitely a huge improvement. I guess I got really unlucky in the first one, but maybe this is a two kill trip. I don't know. I didn't even think a, a two kill crossbow trip was possible, but I guess I'm gonna attempt. Oh shit. Manta rays. I might actually have this. I might actually be able to pull this off. Hold on. Please just die. Please. I want the two armor KC. Is that it? Yes. Yes. Two kill armor trip. Was really not expecting that. Hold on. Let me switch to the blowpipe real quick. And uh, maybe we can get something on our way out here. Oh. Okay. Wasn't actually expecting to get anything, but... uh. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to let this one go. I'm never doing this one. It's too much of a hot spot, honestly. I don't know if it's a hot spot, but if it's a place where people go, let's just, let's call it there. Oh, you don't know frustration until you accidentally put something that you need in your looting bag. I needed these for bandos, but I guess I'm killing bandos in climbing boots now. God damn it. Alright boys, climbing boots at the ready. Uh, if I kill bandos here, there's only one more task left to go. Let's go grab some tacits and leave. Oh my god, please don't make me teleport. Yes! Oh, I didn't think I was gonna get that. I honestly didn't think I was gonna get that. I got ranged so many times. Loop have a key. It's all right. The task is done. Alright, I'm gonna finish off these minions real quick, then we will finish off the diary. It's only one more thing to do. Craft 56 Astral Runes at once. That's the last thing I need to do, so, um, guess I need to clear my inventory, don't I? I think when I was doing the runecrafting tasks, I completely forgot this existed, but you can claim your free pure essence from this guy, and you don't have to mine it on your own to complete the runecrafting task. Alright, this puts an end to the Fremenic Elite Diary tasks. Really happy to have that done. Such a nice diary to have completed. Noted bones, the whole lot, man. Uh, let's just update this real quick for the four, four squares. Alright, how do I get back there? I think I have boots on. Okay, never mind. Wait a second. I can destroy this thing forever. Oh my god, it's so good. Yes! I hated getting that thing all the time. Alright, 64k from 79 herb lore. Awesome to have that done. And yeah, unlimited teleports. I don't know if I'll ever use them really, but 
it's nice to have. Alright, so 4 out of 11 diaries completed. So many more to go. Uh, Kandarin is pretty much completable at any time. It's only really the Barbarian Assault that's stopping me. I'm not sure how I'm going to go about that. Um, I was going to do it with some clan mates, but it's really difficult for me because I'd have to stay the entire round through. All my stuff would be at Zora, so I basically have to do all the Barbarian Assault in one go. I can't just like drop it for a bit and then go do other things, so it's really annoying for me. I just have to find a dedicated team or something that's willing to do it with me for, I don't know, like 10 hours, which is really a lot to ask for. Uh, Mauritania, uh, I can do everything here except the shark, which is what I was thinking. I think I'm going to grind this out. I'm 81 fishing right now, so that's 10 levels. That would put me 20, 87 total. Would give me a lot of time to farm as well. I really need to do some farming, so... Alright, guess we have our next uh, next target, Mauritania Diary. Enable camera motion. Oh. Oh, I'm so immersed. I am so immersed right now. It feels like I'm on the boat, man. Alright, so obviously I'm here for the full English set. I don't think anyone plays this game for XP or fun times. If you do, get some help, please. Um... So what I want is, obviously I want to fish minnows with the, uh, with the angler set. It's really good for that because I get noted sharks, which I think is now the only way for me to get noted sharks, unless I camp like brine rats or something. Not exactly something I want to do. Uh, but also I want the uh, angler set for the XP boost, which I think it'll save me like, I don't know, 250k XP till 99, because I already have 81, but... Yeah, so both of those things figured I might as well get them since I collect sets in my house anyway, so yeah. That didn't even take long, that was like four trips, dude. First piece, just like that, nice. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> angler top, let's go. Oh, only one more piece, one piece to go. My luck has been pretty damn average, if I'm being honest. I think I've done around 30 trips for three pieces, which, you know, could be worse, could be a lot better. I don't care. It's it's all good. Yeah, that's it. We're done. Hell yeah, the hat is the best piece too, so. If I remember correctly, this thing weighs like a billion kilograms. Yeah, 49, dude. Oh, gross. Well, I guess my only option right now is to barbarian fish because I don't even have minnows unlocked, so. Quick little pro tip, if you ever need swamp tar for, I don't know, I guess three ticking is really the only thing. Um, I guess there are probably some other uses, but... If you ever need Swamp Tar, this ship that takes you to Pirate Cove and also to Lunar Isle, it keeps three barrels of Swamp Tar in the bottom, so you just hop worlds, take the tar, it's pretty easy. Alright, here we go, first level coming in, 82 fishing, 20, 78 total. I have actually decided that I am going to Minnows, uh, which is kind of embarrassing because I just bought 40k feathers. Uh, I think this is definitely the best decision. I want, I think I'll get like... 40k sharks in total getting to 91 and that's like a lifetime supply. I don't think I'll ever need more than that So I'm gonna go uh, gonna go to minnows for 82 to 91 and then 91 to 99 is gonna be all three tick barb fishing So yeah, see there. Hey, here we go first level actually didn't take too long at all nearly a hundred K stack of minnows I guess I'm just gonna update you guys on the minnows and the uh, the herbs that I'm gonna be farming the entire time one thing about minnows is it's super good for farm runs, like ridiculously good. I can just keep the uh, seed dibber, the spade on me at all times, don't need much inventory space at all for minnows, so it's really nice for that. I have so many seeds to get through, I think I've got around 600, which I should be able to get through all of them. I guess you can probably tell how much time this is going to take me, probably around 100 something hours, but yeah, there you go. That's, that's a lot of seeds to get through. Okay, so it's not 600, it's more like 530. Alright, that was the last Toad Flax harvest, which means I'm going to be moving on to the Aventos. The Aventos are actually the most important because I'm going to need them for herbivores, which I'm doing right after fishing, so got to make sure I get the Aventos, which I definitely will because I have a shit ton of time until 91. Alright, here we go. 84 fishing, 2080 total. It's a nice number. 200k minnows too. And uh, I guess not much has moved since the last clip on the, on the farming. My man Baloney Boy here wanted a shout out, so he's currently under a drunken dwarf's leg. But thank you for watching the videos, man. Really appreciate it. Not even halfway there. It really feels like I've been here for like an eternity, but I'm not even halfway there. There's 86, five levels to go. I didn't think I'd get a level from farm runs, but... I guess I have only herbs for uh, for 86 to 87. I got 86 last video off a of tithe farm, so it was like a completely clean like slate to to 87. So 
It's a lot of XP just for herbs. 88 fishing, getting really close. Very nice. Like to see it. 2085 total too, so it's a small milestone. I started farming the Raynars, by the way. I have so many of these. I had 260 seeds, and I have 951 herbs and 148 left, so it's gonna come around 2.5k, I think, is my estimate. Uh, it's gonna be a lot. I don't even know where I'm gonna use those, but I actually managed to finish off the herb lore level with just cleaning these herbs, and also Tears of Guthics once, but God damn, that was a lot of XP. Just for cleaning herbs from farm runs, that's huge, so. Yep, almost done with fishing, by the way. Uh, I'm actually going to talk to you about something when I get this next level. I don't think I'm going to be going for 91 anymore off minnows. I think I'm going to finish it off with something else, but I'll get into that next clip. Uh, one more level for 80 base stats for, uh, for Herblore. All right, there we go. 89 fishing. I wanted to talk about this because I'm not going to be finishing up at minnows. I'm going to be turning in my minnows here. 961k, really close to the 1 mil mark, but I'm going to have to turn it in. So my reasoning for this, which I'll go over in a second here. Let me just turn these in first. How much is this going to be? 24034. Holy shit. That is a lot. I was expecting to get more. Obviously, the goal was around 40k. But uh, that's not going to happen anymore, and I'll explain why. Let me just do a quick price check here, because this is probably something people want to see. Uh, I think sharks have dropped quite a bit, but yeah, 16 mil seems about right from 82 to 89 fishing. So that's what you can expect if you want to go for this. Um, so why did I stop minnows? Uh, I don't need that many sharks is basically the case that I'm making here. I'm going to use maybe around 11, 12k for PVM. Uh, I think Bandos is going to, I don't know, uh, if I go 1,000 kills dry at Bandos, maybe I'll need more more than that, but I really won't. So I'm going to be cooking a lot of them for cooking XP. I think I calculated out around 96 cooking and still having around 12k left. So they're just going to contribute to the cooking XP. I'll finish off the rest of the cooking XP at Zolra when I go back to Zolra. Uh, Zolra drops grapes, so I'll just finish off 96 to 99 at Zolra. So no harm done. This wasn't a waste of time. Or, uh, this wasn't a waste of time or anything. I just this XP is way too fucking slow, and I'm running out of seeds, so it's not really worth doing. I've been looking forward to this for a while. The big 90. Only one level to go after this, but it's another 90 stat on the account that I'm really happy to see. 2088 total. I can now catch Chiron fish, which I don't think anyone even fishes in raids if I'm being honest. It's done! Of course I missed the level. God damn it, I'm actually kind of upset. 91 fishing, 2089 total. God damn, that took a long time. Uh, if I didn't do minnows, I think I would have done this in about 40 hours. Uh, I've been fishing for two weeks, I think. It's been pretty bad. Uh, let's just turn this into some Herblore XP right now. Decided while I was getting the tuna for the Admiral Pie, I'd just fish the uh, five sharks here and cook them for the Kandran Elite, because I think I'll be doing that pretty soon, so two birds with one stone. Oh, okay, that wasn't too long at all. Didn't even need the second slice of pie. Awesome. All right, that was the hardest thing I actually had to do for that diary, so no, I didn't mean to drop that. Somehow I haven't taken the opportunity, even with my DH stored here for... I don't even know how long. I didn't loot the Barrow's chest with a full set of armor, so... Yeah, if a lot of you, uh, I don't know if how many of you knew that I had that stored there, honestly, but there we go. 1302, man. It's been so long since I've done Barrows. I didn't even remember my uh, my chest count for the longest time, but I might be coming back here for an Aram skirt. I don't know yet. I don't know. It's for another time, another day. Hopefully this will work with the regular uh, remains. Yeah, let's go. It's done. Mauritania Elite Task done. 300 coins. Let's go. Profit. Um... All right, let's go claim our reward. You know what I completely forgot about this diary? I get another herb patch from this. Like, it's huge, actually. I don't know how I'm gonna get to Harmony Island yet because I haven't thought that far. I completely forgot that I even get the patch, but definitely in the top three diaries right here. Another herb patch is gonna speed things up a lot. Um, damn, that's a, that's a pretty big, that's even bigger than I thought. This was a huge diary to complete then. All right, 50K herb lore experience as usual. Puts me 130k away from uh, from 80. Not bad, dude. Not bad. So I did the math. If I were to get 96 cooking with the raw sharks that I have, I'd still have 11,773 left. So not only do I get super fast cooking experience, but I also have a ton of sharks for PVM. So honestly, I don't see a downside to it. If you do, let me know. 
I'll check it out. So I think there's one thing that I completely didn't think of and it's that I don't have any seeds. I farmed all of them during fishing and if I want to do herbivores it's definitely a good time to do farming during it so I have to get some seeds. Uh, I don't know where my rogue gear is, but I'm gonna be pickpocketing master farmers. I think it might be up here actually Hello, yeah, there it is. All right, and I need my thieving cape So I'm gonna be pickpocketing master farmers, which I heard is really really good seeds I've been wanting to do it for a while, but I haven't really gotten around to it So I'm gonna test it out. Uh, I will get back to you on the rates and stuff but Yeah, I got a ton of stuff done in this video. So thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna end it here if you missed the last one, it'll be in the uh, little end screen annotation. Next video, I'm going to be doing a lot of pickpocketing. I don't know if I'm going to keep doing Master Farmers for Seeds, so I'm just going to have to check it out. Next episode, 99 Hunter, maybe? I'm not sure. It depends how fast Herbivores go. Uh, I think it's around 80 hours for 99. I know I'm always throwing out like these huge amounts of hours. Obviously, I'm not doing this shit in like one day. It's spread across a lot of days. I just, obviously, it takes me a while to put together content and stuff, and I'm honestly don't have all the time in the world right now so otherwise thank you so much for watching i appreciate you so much see you in the next episode